All right, hello everybody. This is Ms. Hammonds. Um, this is a short demonstration video to show you how you're able to either create blank Cornell notes for your students to type on and then you can go in and modify it or how to um, upload a template um, that Avid provides for us and have them just type over it. All right, so um, once you're in your corn, um, you're in your OneNote, I'm sorry. Once you're in your OneNote, let me get out of this. And I've already input, input a template here. So this will also be attached for you. All right, so going back to my demo. First thing you have to do is, if you're going to create, you'll go to, I'm looking for it. Okay, so you'll go to view, and then it says rule lines. So from there, you're actually able to, you know, click on the spacing that you want for the paper. Um, make sure you have space for the title and any other information that you want across the top. Um, if there's any essential question, thank you. Um, Oops. All right. So this will be my essential question. I'm gonna move that up just a little. All right. Next thing I need to do is draw because I need to section off the portions of my Cornell notes. So you're gonna click on draw, go to shape, and then choose the line. All right, so I tell my students, like if we're doing it on paper, take your two index fingers, start from the line, the red line, and then draw a line straight, straight down to kind of section off that page. So I'm gonna scroll up, use this kind of as my template, and I'm just gonna go down straight as I can. All right, and then release. All right, so that has this section set up for me. So this is where, after all of my notes have been filled over here, I can write questions or give me a word that I'm defining and so on and so forth. All right, so the next thing I need is a section for my summary. So we're gonna go back to draw, get the line, and then start here on across. All right, and because it's an electronic version, you can kind of make it as long or as short as you want. Like if you're gonna have students taking notes and it's gonna consume several pages, um, you can make this this original line or the initial line go down further so you're not having to have a lot of different sections. All right, so now that my page is set up, because our students don't have a, a pen with their surface, um, you may not want to require them to actually write with these initially. All they have to do is go down here where they can click and type. So, all right. So, um, this is basically your 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 setup. So let's.